for you. And the locals wanted to call it the Chili Bowl because we have chili here, green, green chili. But we're like, wait a second, we know that, but people back east would think of Texas. Texas chili. The chili Bowl doesn't work. So, green chili. Have you had a chance to try any green chili? Do you like it? Chili burger. Green yes. chili cheeseburger? How about uh, red chili? Have you tried that? How about you? Have you had a chance to green chili? Oh, you got to try it while you're here. They, they put it on everything here. Yeah, everything. I mean, they got green. My favorite, green green chili corn dog. They got those at the state fair. They are out of this world. Uh, so, you like red or green, whatever it is, typically you probably favor one or the other. And then they got another deal out here they'll ask you, uh, what about uh, Christmas? You like Christmas, yeah, red and green. That's what they want. So uh, somebody asks you, you're out at a restaurant, they ask you, what, you know, red or green? Hey, what are you talking about? Because when I got here, I was from Georgia, moved here, red or green, I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. So now I'm, I, I'm partial to green. Yeah, that's, that's what I like. I'm trying to get my bearings straight here. Okay, we're kind of, uh, we're south now of downtown Albuquerque, so we're heading due south right now. This is what's the beauty of Albuquerque. You just look and see where the Sandias are and you kind of know which direction you're heading in. So we're heading due south. We're coming up to the uh, the country club area again here. We're kind of on the back side of that. And we're going to be approaching kind of our, uh, well, it's a, it's a nice cultural area here with the zoo, the botanical gardens. Tingley Beach, and we'll, we'll show you this. This is uh, where the old mayor, Mayor Martin Chavez, who was, I want to say he was the mayor for like three terms, maybe 12 years, something like that. He was here for a long time. Um, he, he was kind of the force behind a lot of this here, where he really wanted to build up uh, the river area. There's a Channel 4 news guy right there. Yeah, that's a recognize that. Another guy, but I see his face. That guy, he's Yeah, yeah, news guy. And they live down here. So uh, Albuquerque's got all these different zones. You know, we talk about the quadrants of the city itself. Well, you have the you know, the high desert we're in. You got the mountains over here, which if you were to go to the San Diego, you'd be in feet of snow. You got the west the west base over this way, and then along the river here, which the Rio Grande is right over here, is the Bosque, cottonwoods, giant cottonwoods. Now over the years, as with a lot of places around the country. We haven't had a lot of rainfall, it's been dry, you know, season after season of just not enough rain and it's been too dry. We get these fires down here, and just a little fire and the wind, next thing you know, you've got problems. So over the course of the last few years, we've had some big fires down here, and so they've really made an effort to go in and clean it up, the underbrush here. So this is the Bosque, it's called, and people will walk and bike down there. You see ride the horses down there, all kinds of stuff. It's, it's open, it's a really nice area. Usually it's a couple of degrees, a little cooler. On the right is the uh, the Albuquerque Zoo. And I think we may, may get a shot up. We, I didn't see the polar bear out there, but the elephants there. are out elephants. here. Here's some alpacas. This is kind of the back side of the zoo here. It is a really cool zoo. They were telling me that it got started when the circus came to town and they got a couple of the lions, I guess, to create the start of the zoo here. But there's some of the elephants that are out there. It's a, it's a nice zoo, it really is. You don't think of Albuquerque as a zoo, but it's a, it's a really cool zoo. 